Right, gang, in the news today, House of Fraser. Oh, poor House of Fraser closing 31 of their 59 stores, which is a huge amount. And it's the death of retail, as it seems. Well, no, not really, because some retailers are excelling. And we're going to talk about the ones that are excelling and why they're excelling. But things are changing. What is really causing the cancer of retail on these businesses? Because government have increased business rates. They've, uh, the, the cost of VAT, the cost of employment has gone up, say, from five to seven years ago. Um, and the birth of this thing called the internet all these things are having a fast effect on the death of these businesses and it's not just house of fraser who have we had recently channels we've had toys r us we've had Woolworths. we've had british home stores we've had maplins uh, they've all gone um, and they're going and there will be more so who is next well um i'll tell you anyone who doesn't understand the difference between competing on price and competing on experience, those that trade around the middle ground are struggling and they will continue to struggle. Those that compete on price like Lidl and Audi, they're going to stay in the game. Those that compete on experience like Apple, like Disney, uh, like Hamleys, like Harrods, they will stay in the game because people want two things. They either want low prices or they want an experience. This book here that I pen shutters, the experience business tells you all about that. You've got to choose which camp you're in. You can beat them on price or you can beat them on experience. We can't flip between the two and that's what's happened with House of Fraser. They don't know what they are and uh, they're going to continue to struggle because the cost of being a brick and mortar business is going up and only the best will remain. Now I've got some notes here for you. Look at this thing here. Hold out your phone. Amazon is bringing a huge speed into retail. Uh, and that's happening all the time. Look, when you queue up to go into a store like Toys R Us and there's a massive queue and there's screaming kids around and you don't know if you've got the best price or not, when well, you can go onto Amazon and within three clicks you get the thing delivered to you the next day and you haven't had to get in the car and you haven't had to go into that disastrous, disastrous experience of retail, you can get what you want far quicker. And that's why they're winning. That's why Netflix beat Blockbuster and there is so many so many stories of this going on if you want to know more check out how you can build an experienced business that's why i wrote a book about it it's a good thing to do thanks for watching bye bye